Hi, this is, uh, my name is Hannah Chung. This is Jerry the Bear, an interactive teaching tool for kids with type 1 diabetes. So kids take care of Jerry by pricking his fingers, giving him insulin and feeding him foods to learn what it takes to manage your diabetes. And Jerry makes it really fun. So will you give him a demonstration? Sure. So uh, the first, to check how he's feeling, you squeeze one of his hands. I feel great. Jerry feels great. Uh, Jerry comes with 10 different foods and an insulin pen. So uh, to first feed him, you choose one of the foods. Uh, in this case, I'm going to use a cracker. Um, and to feed him, you just swipe the food across his mouth. Yummy! It says yummy, and you can see what the plate is. And for kids, we make this really visual because carbs is very uh, number-based, but for kids three to seven, they don't know numbers yet. So what we do is uh, we represent it by dots so that one dot is equal to five carbs. For one dot of food, you need one dot of insulin. So after I feed him this, Thanks. I can use his insulin pen and tap it on one of his six sides. So he has two injection sites on his legs, two on his arms, and two on his butt. So I can use a pen, tap it on one of his sites, and it triggers the insulin dosing screen. So I can toggle up. I'm giving him one dot because we gave him one dot of food. And okay, that's how you take care of Jerry. And of course, uh, if you don't feed him correctly or don't give him the right amount of insulin, his blood sugar can be very high or low. And when that happens, Jerry will say, I'm feeling sick, I'm feeling dizzy, I'm feeling sweaty, to help kids understand which terminology to use to express their symptoms. Okay. So Hannah, mm -hmm. how did Jerry come about? So Jerry came about uh, first, from a personal passion and the biggest insight that we have seen from researching with users. Uh, for me, my father's family and grandparents have type 2 diabetes. So growing up, I knew about diabetes but didn't know the complication behind it until my uh, grandfather passed away from hypoglycemia when I was in sixth grade. So it was his first time to understand diabetes can actually kill people. It's a very serious disease. Um, but when I came across to work on uh, helping ki people with type 1 diabetes or diabetes in general, uh, you know, we went to the hospital and talked to parents and to do a lot of research. And what we have seen is that in family homes, kids were using their plush animal, stapling a drawing of an insulin pump, giving them injections to cope their disease. And um, you know, for parents, because kids are so young, they are not supposed to touch their medical equipment. Kids are confused why they are going through the process, and parents are stressed out because it's a really hard uh, management that kids are really not enjoying it. So from those insights, we decided to bridge those two together, make learning really fun, and really giving a great avenue for kids to cope their disease. And that's how Jerry came about. And Jerry's also teaching kids how to care. Could you explain about that? Yeah, sure. So Jerry um, has, in addition to taking care of Jerry, Jerry has um, a curriculum built. So it's a story of Jerry training for the All-Stars game, kind of like the Olympics. So he travels to different worlds, learn different sports, help, ch help another friend, and learn about diabetes. So he has 21 different uh, interactive and educational storybooks. And to unlock new stories, you need to take care of Jerry really well. So for example, um, Jerry will meet a monkey friend named Momo, and he helps Momo come down the tree. And when they're learning about climbing, Momo will say, Climbing is just like side rotation. You need to rotate your arms, legs, and butt to go up the tree, same thing. And the task will be uh, give Jerry insulin in different injection sites. <laughs> so it kind of links those together. And Jerry laughs a lot. Yep, he's, what made him laugh? So he has uh, tickle sensors that we call on his ears and his uh, armpits. <laughs> so if you trigger it, uh, Jerry giggles. Sometimes uh, when Jerry's very full, he burps. He farts. Uh, we try to make it very fun so that kids are really, um, they want to play with Jerry, and Jerry has personality. <laughs> <laughs> How long did it take to design Jerry? So I started four and a half years ago when I was a student. Uh, so far, uh, we built 20, 30 different prototypes, tested with about 350 kids or more, and we uh, shipped our first production run last Christmas, and that was 250 bears. And now we are just shipping more bears and more families are having it in the United States. So how many people have you um, impacted so far? Impacted uh, 300 total, but our aim is to do way more than that this summer. 
And what is your big vision for Jerry? The big vision for Jerry is um, for type 1 diabetes kids to uh, get the Jerry to all hands of children diagnosed to really make uh, learning, really f learning about diabetes really fun, but as a company to use the technology that we created for pediatric health education through Jerry to apply to different diseases such as asthma, autism, and obesity to really bring a lot of innovation for unmet uh, current diseases that kids are going through. And Hannah, what is your big challenge now? What, what you, what's your next big challenge? The next big challenge, uh, of course, expanding to a bigger market like asthma, uh, but also uh, we're launching a big uh, crowdfunding campaign this summer to get Jerry to 100% of all children diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. Uh, that's 12,000 kids. So I think getting Jerry to all those kids uh, in, a, in the summertime to bring the community together and make that happen, it's a, it's a, it's a daring, uh, it's a daring uh, campaign that we are doing, but I think it's it's on the right track. We have a great vision for Jerry and really trying to help kids, so I think we can do it. How much money do you need to raise? Uh, to help 12,000 kids, uh, we need $3 million. And how much will Jerry cost per bear? Uh, right now, Jerry is cost for about uh, $300, between 280 and 300 um, But as we um, scale, we are hoping to uh, lower the price of Jerry even more to help even families who can't afford to get a bear, but I think the summer campaign will actually be actually be a great testing point to get all families who even who even who, who uh, they can't afford to get a Jerry and really create that impact that we want to make. And is your vision that Jerry will be available free to people in the end through the healthcare? Or? I think uh, ultimately uh, we can see insurance companies reimbursing this or even uh, Jerry given out to new families like, all the time when they uh, see newly diagnosed children. Um, I think it takes a long step to get there, but ideally, um, just on the moment when kids are diagnosed with type 1 diabetes, we want them to get a Jerry the Bear. So, what have you had to sort of grapple with being an entrepreneur? Did you set out to be an entrepreneur? Um, I guess I'm not. Um, I was very interested in helping kids with type 1 diabetes, so it was started out as I love working on Jerry the Bear. I wanted to prototype, I wanted to test with kids, and I realized to continue the journey and make that impact, it has to be a business, I have to build a business around it to continue the innovation and find talented people to work with me to make this vision come true. So I think uh, Jerry t helped me to become an entrepreneur, and I'm really glad that I took that path. Thank you. Thank you.